I, I came outside with my chihuahua, put him in the yard, his name is Chico, and what I recognized was, and I'm not talking about a little bit of poop, I'm talking about two giant piles of poop on a brand new synthetic lawn that I had had my company put in for the owner of the complex. So what do you do? You see the defendant? Is he awake? It had just gotten up, it seemed. He would look a little groggy, and his windows faced the yard, right? So I looked in, I said, Dylan, there's a couple big piles out here, dude. Can you please come out and get these up? Hey, did you yell at him? Heck no. You said you called out. I voiced to him, Dylan, can you come and get okay. the dog poop? All right, Dylan came outside. Mm -hmm. And you claim he was highly aggressive. Immediately. Mr. Black. On July 4th, I was asleep and I heard Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. He starts saying your name. Repeatedly, yes. Repeatedly. Until I finally wake up, I crawl out of bed. You were bed. sleeping. Yes, correct. When he was saying your name. That, the first thing I heard in the morning was my name being repeated from somewhere. He repeated to do so until he saw me, I believe, and then he said, your dog has poop out here. So I told him not to bother me and that I'll be out in a moment to pick it up. And then he said, what? I can't hear you. Come on out. And so I went outside and I told him that I did not disturb him when I come home after work at three in the morning and step on his dog poop. I don't wake him up. So I wish that he would just show me the same respect. And then I went inside, I grabbed a bag, and I picked up the poop, and then I threw it away. All right, Mr. Buono, you claim he comes out, and he came out looking a total mess. Yes. He had vomit in his beard. It was dried vomit, from what I could True? See. Correct. You did? Yes. Okay, oh, go ahead. Wow. And so he came out aggressive. He says, stop <laughs> telling me to pick up the poop. And he said it multiple times. I says, I have a chihuahua. And they're hard little poops. And I picked them up at, as fast as I possibly can. On occasion, maybe he had stepped on one of my dog's poops. I apologize for that. I mean, that's, that's mm -hmm. a... Never apologized and, okay. Mm -mm. Go ahead. So the bottom line is, he kept going. And I turned to my left to look at my dog over here. He literally blindsided me so hard hard as you could possibly push a human being into the fence, which was to my left, where I was leaning. My ribs and my side were over the top of this three and a half foot okay. fence. And I had to push off with my elbow to try to get myself back up. Is this the area of the complex? That is correct. All right. And all I did was grimace and say, Dylan, you can't do that, dude. You can't. Wait, he pushed you as hard as a human can possibly push another human. And you had the presence of mind to just say, Dylan, don't do that. Your Honor, I had been in bed for almost three months. Fair I enough. was so ill. So you didn't, I have, didn't, the, even you didn't have, have the energy. energy to even yeah. defend myself. But you weren't even angry at him? Oh, you didn't even God, say, yes. like. Why was I angry? But I just grimaced because I was in so much pain. Okay. My ribs were so jacked up. And I said, you can't do that. He goes, oh, yeah, old man. He goes, die, old man. Just like that. And I just walked right by him. Are you him. still intoxicated at this point in the morning? No, ma'am. Did you say die, old man? Die, old man? No, that's terrible. Did you push him? No, I didn't None of this. Him. This is just like a figment yeah. of his imagination. Yes, ma'am. Judge Corriero. Mr. Buono, you say that your daughter witnessed all of this, is that correct? Correct. Is this your daughter? This yep. is my daughter. Come up, please. Thank What's you. your name? My name is Chloe. Tell us what you saw that morning. So I woke up around 9.30, 9.45. So I got up and I heard my dad talking outside with Dylan. What did I you hear them saying to each other, if anything? My dad said, can you please pick up the poop? And immediately I heard aggressive tone from Mr. Black. And I saw my dad get leaned over the fence, shoved onto the fence on his left side, and he said to Mr. Black, hey, dude, why did you do that? You can't do that. Did you actually see... I saw it with my own eyes. ...the defendant yes. shove yep. your father? Yep. You indicated... You gave us a photograph of the injury. Yeah, I right. took those photos. When did you take them? 9.58 a.m. Is this the photograph? Yep. That, correct. That shows the injury that you sustained? From a three-foot fence, correct. It looks like a scraping? Yeah, it's a wooden fence that's rough. It's uh, rough on top. I actually folded over the top of it. And so how long after the incident did you actually take this? Minutes after. I Immediately after I saw the incident, I raced back inside of the house. I was going for my five iron because I was going to hit Mr. Black in the head for assaulting my father. Oh, you were a golfer? Yep. <laughs> but dad was immediately behind me and he said, absolutely not. So we called the cops. 